on the subscribe button and press on the bell icon to watch my all new videos my dear this is Joel Kumar Sen and you are watching with Joel Kumar Sen YouTube channel so today in this tutorial what I am going to share with you that is all about fluid mechanics so let's we'll start from the new topic that is what fluid mechanics so as you know we have studied studying fluid from mechanics so basically there are two subjects to study in mechanical engineering as well as in civil engineering we studied about this but yeah i'm a mechanical engineer so definitely i will talk more about mechanical engineering so uh, so there are two types there are two subjects we study in this uh, in this matter that is fluid one is fluid mechanics another one is fluid machines so today i will discuss with you the concept of fluid mechanics so let's get started right so basically what is fluid we need to understand about it so fluid means what it is uh, it is it is a part of matter right so basically if you will divide matter so there are three types of matter basically solid liquid and gas and combination that means fluid is it is a combination of what liquid as well as gas that means it can be liquid or it can be gas that means what i mean to say that liquid or gas both are fluid okay so in this tutorial i mean in this subject what we study liquid as well as gas and their mechanism all right i hope you are getting my point what i wanted to make you understand so the combination of liquid that I means it could be liquid as well as gas so what is the definition of fluid uh, its definition is which is having capability to follow that means capability to flow so capability to flow is known as what fluid all right i hope you got it so let's move on okay now come to mechanics i hope you have studied a uh, studied a subject that is engineering mechanics okay no problem if you forgot some things i will help you to recall all those things what you have studied earlier so mechanics basically there are two things we have studied in mechanics one is what kinematics right and another one is what dynamics all right so whenever we are studying uh, studying about fluid whenever we are studying about fluid without consideration of force we will not consider force in that case it is known as what kinematics but fluid will be in motion and whenever we are studying fluid with consideration of force is known as what dynamics so this is the case of what fluid the same thing is happening with motion of any object of or anything or any body maybe we which you have studied in theory of machine all right so this is all about the fluid so basically what you need to understand fluid is a it could be liquid or gas the definition is capability to flow and uh, the matter having three types which you have already studied in earlier class and mechanics there are two types kinematics and dynamics well i had changed little bit of my tutorial that means the way of representing tutorial i have changed in each and every tutorial at the end you will get something amazing information about that topic which topic i am teaching so today i will share with you three most important key concepts of fluid mechanics which will be quite useful for you maybe those things will ask in the competitive examination all right so are you ready to learn those three most important key points about the basic concept of fluid mechanics i hope so so let's get started so this is the first point i would like to share with you that is density of fluid is a point function density of fluid is a point function i hope you got it right second point the first point i wanted to share with the density of fluid is a point function second point i would like to share with you it is based on it is based on continuum principle 
All right, maybe you have you have already studied about uh, continuum approach. Actually, there are two types of approach we have studied in thermodynamics. One is microscopic, another one is macroscopic. So, continuum approach means macroscopic approach. The same here in fluid mechanics, we will study continuum. I mean, continuum approach that is macroscopic things. All right, now next. The last point of this, the last most important point of this video tutorial, all right, words that fluid will deform, deform due to sharing forces. Well, how it is working, I mean, how fluid will undergo deformation due to sharing forces or uh, shear stress we will understand about it later on in next topics well well thanks for watching thank you very much well now i would like i want you to do four things what are those subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed till now press on the bell icon as well as share this video tutorial with your friends that's why they will also understand about the topic i have shared with you and next point is what comment or uh, below what you think about this video tutorial and at the last please give like button that's why i will get inspired from the like uh, likes and shares all right so thanks for watching thank you very much and hope to see you again in my next video tutorial bye bye